Hi there, it's David here and I'd like to welcome you to this video where I'll show you the new computerized badminton court allocation system called Badboard. Badboard is incredibly easy to use yet employs really powerful features and algorithms to make sure that your players get equal amounts of court time with well-matched games. So let's take a look. This is the main bad board screen. As you can see, the software is broken into four main sections. First, you have the court section. This is where teams currently playing on court are displayed. In the next area, you have the waiting to play section. This is where individual players waiting to play are displayed. Next is the timer section. Here you can automate your games, see how much time is left for each game and start and stop the timer along with other functions. Finally we have the unavailable to play section. People who haven't arrived, who have left or anyone who no longer wishes to play for the session is displayed here. Let's start by adding players to the waiting to play section. There are four ways to do this. The first is to click the green play symbol next to a player's name. The second is to double click a player's name. The third is to click on a player's name then click the add button. And the fourth is to search for the player using the search button, then adding them to the list. Once you've added all the players to the waiting to play section, you can automate the entire playing session simply by clicking auto pick. The system uses a unique and complex algorithm which picks the most suitable playing selections and guarantees equal playing time regardless of playing ability based upon the currently configured system rules. Let's have a look at these now. The system default settings are as follows in the system rules screen. The default mixed play ratio setting is set at 2 to 1 which means where possible the system will attempt to select you for two doubles games for every mixed game. The default played with percentage is set at 50%, which means you cannot play with the same player for more than 50% of your playing time. The default grade spread is set at zero and should only be used by clubs who insist that players only play with players of their own standard. If set, this rule will ignore the played with percentage rule. The default league team's waiting is set at no waiting. This can be changed if the club would like players from the same teams to play with each other. That is, it will apply a bias to the selection algorithm in favour of players on the same league team. The default settings are applicable for most clubs. However, adjusting these rules to suit your own club's preferences may take some additional tweaking until you are happy that the settings are suited to your club. Once the auto pick button has been clicked, the system is designed to run unaided for the entire session. Players need to simply add themselves when they arrive using the methods described earlier and they can remove themselves from play when they are finished by one of the following two methods. They can click on the red stop button icon to the right of their name or they can click on their name then click on the remove button. One further thing to note is that the system's selections can be overridden if required using one of the following two methods. You can drag a player from the waiting to play list or from another court and drop them over the player that is to be replaced. This will result in the two players being switched. Alternately, you can highlight the two players by clicking on each one then click the switch players button. 
There are, of course, numerous other features available within the system which I won't go into on this session. So there you have it, the rough guide for bad board timer-based court allocation software. We hope that you find the system easy to use and that you found this video useful. Thanks for watching and enjoy using Badboard for your badminton club.